hello everyone i am mohammad afifuddin in this video you will see problem based on design of short axially loaded column so here is the problem statement a short rcc square column is required to carry a factored load of 1900 kN design the column assume e minimum by d ratio is less than 0.05 and use m20 concrete and mild steel okay so in the problem statement it is given as a short column is given which is square in shape and the e minimum by d ratio is less than 0.05 and m20 grade of concrete is given and mild steel is given therefore fe250 grade of steel is given So here is the given data. As factored load is given, therefore we will take directly P U is equal to 1900 kilonewton, which is equal to 1900 into 10 raised to 3 newton. F C K is 20 newton per mm square. F Y is 250 newton per mm square. And E minimum by D ratio is given as it is less than 0.05. Therefore, capital D is is greater than 20 upon 0.05. Why? Because E minimum is equal to 20 mm as per as IS 456 2000. Okay. So our first step is to find out the area of steel reinforcement, and we will assume one percentage of steel. Therefore, AS is equal to one percent of gross area. So one percent means one upon hundred, which is equal to 0.01 of AG. now we are calculating all the values here in terms of ag and then we will put into the formula of factored load that is pu okay then our second step is to find out the area of concrete that is ac and we know that to find out the area of concrete we have to deduct area of reinforcement from total area or we can say that from gross area therefore area of concrete is equal to ag minus asc So AG minus zero point zero one AG. Why? Because AC is equal to zero point zero one AG. So AG minus zero point zero one AG is equal to zero point nine nine AG. Then our third step is to calculate the AG, that is gross area. And for that we will use the formula which is given on clause number thirty nine point three of IS four five six two thousand page number seventy one. That PU is equal to 0.4 FCK into AC plus 0.67 FY into ASC. PU is given as 1900 into 10 to 3 Newton. 0.4 FCK is 20. AC we have calculated AC in terms of AG. Okay, that is 0.99 into AG plus 0.67 into mild steel is given. That that means FY is equal to 250. And ASC we have calculated in terms of AG again. That is 0.01 into AG. So after putting this value, and we can find out the value of gross area. That is, AG is equal to 198020 mm square. Okay. Now it's time to calculate dimensions of column. As in the problem statement, square column is given. Therefore, side of column is equal to under root of AG. Therefore, under root of one nine eight zero two zero is equal to four forty four point nine nine mm. So we will adopt the higher value. Okay. So we will adopt this one side as four fifty mm. Therefore, the size of column as square column is given. Therefore, size of column will be four fifty by four fifty mm. Then our fifth step is to calculate the area of reinforcement. As in step number one, we calculated. That ASC, that is area of reinforcement, is equal to 0.01 into gross area. Therefore, 0.01 into gross area is 450 by 450. Therefore, area of reinforcement is equal to 2025 mm square. Now we will assume 20 mm diameter of bar. Therefore, number of bar is equal to area of reinforcement upon area of one bar, which is equal to 6.44. Let us say seven bars. Therefore, provide seven bars of twenty mm diameter. Now we will check the ASC provided. 
that is area of steel provided so 7 bars of 20 mm diameter which is equal to 2199 mm square now our last step is design of lateral ties and for that firstly we have to calculate the diameter of lateral ties and the diameter should not be less than 1 by 4 of diameter or 6 mm whichever is more so 1 by 4 of diameter is equal to 5 mm and 6 mm and the high we will take the higher value therefore we will use 6 mm diameter ties and then we will find out the spacing of ties okay and spacing of ties should not be exceed least lateral dimension or 16 5 or 300 mm so least lateral dimension is 450 mm 16 dia is equal to 320 mm or 300 mm therefore we will provide the minimum spacing we will provide 6 mm diameter bar at 300 mm center to center as lateral ties and here is the cross section of our design column here the overall dimensions are 450 by 450 mm and we are going to provide 7 bars of 20 mm diameters so here we have completed the numerical based on design of short columns thank you